Good morning, students. Welcome to your English class. My name is Carlos Silva and I'm your English teacher. This is day number one of unit three. Are you ready to learn English? El día de hoy comenzamos la unidad tres. Este es el primer día de la unidad tres. So let's begin. Ordinal numbers. Let's explore ordinal numbers. Today, you are gonna explore ordinal numbers and also understand the function of ordinal numbers and practice them. El día de hoy vamos a comprender los números ordinales. También vamos a explorar para qué sirven y vamos a practicarlos un poco. So let's begin. What are ordinal numbers? Let's pay attention. An ordinal number is a number that tells you the position of something in a list. Un número ordinal nos va a indicar la posición de algo o alguien, ya sea en una lista o en algo que tenga cierto orden. Yes, we can use ordinal numbers to tell the position of something or somebody. Most ordinal numbers end in TH, that is, yes, la mayoría de los números ordinales terminan con TH y su pronunciación es como si fueras una viborita, eh, tienes que poner tus labios, tu lengua entre tus dientes y eh, soltar un poco de aire para hacer la pronunciación de TH. Uh -huh, something like that. But there are also other endings like ST, ND, and RD. También tenemos estas terminaciones para algunos números ordinales. ST, ND, and RD. Yes? So let's check what do we have here? Ordinal numbers. Listen and repeat the ordinal numbers. Vamos a escuchar y repetir los números ordinales. First, please repeat. First, this is how we write the ordinal number and this is the numeral. First, please repeat. First, hmm? Now, look at the picture. Look at the picture. Who is the first? Who is in first place? First, yes. The ordinal number is indicating that this boy is in first place. Very well. The next one. Second, please repeat, second. This is the written form and this is the numeral. Now, look at the picture again. Who is in second place? This girl right here, second. Mm -hmm. The ordinal number is showing us the position of the girl in the race. Second, el número ordinal en esta imagen nos muestra quién está en el segundo lugar. Second. Third, please repeat. Third, here is the written form and this is the numeral. Third. Look at the picture. Who is in third place? This girl right here is in third place. The ordinal number is showing us the position of this girl in the race. El número ordinal nos muestra la posición de la niña en esta carrera. Fourth. Look at the picture. Fourth. Who is in fourth place? That is correct. This is the fourth 
place. The ordinal number show us the position of this girl in the race. Fourth. Fifth. Fifth. This is the written form and this is the numeral. Fifth. Who is in fifth place? Look at the race. Who is in fifth place? That is correct. This is the fifth place. The ordinal number show us the position of this boy in the race. Sixth. Sixth. This is the, num uh, the numeral and here we have the, the name of the ordinal number. Now look at the picture. Who is in sixth place? This boy. That is correct. The ordinal number shows the position of this boy in the race. Now, seventh, seventh. This is the written form and this is the numeral. Seventh, who is in seventh place? Look at the picture. Who is in seventh place? This girl right here is in seventh place. Eighth, eighth. Look at the picture right here. This is the mm, written form and this is the numeral. Eighth. Who is in eighth place? Can you identify the position? Who is in eighth place. That is correct. This boy right here is in eighth place. Ninth. Ninth. This is the written form and this is the numeral. Who is in ninth place right here? Look at the picture. This boy right here is in ninth place. The ordinal number shows the position of this boy and its position is ninth. Tenth. Tenth. This is a written form and this is the numeral. Who is in tenth place? Look at the picture. This girl is in 10th place. That means she's the last one, right? Very well. I hope you enjoyed this activity. Now let's review the ordinal numbers. First, second, third, fourth, fifth, Sixth, seventh, eighth, ninth, tenth. Very well, students. Now let's work on activity number one ordinal numbers. Match the numeral with the name of the number. Lo que tenemos que hacer aquí es unir el nombre del número ordinal con eh, el número que tenemos. Ok, puedes checar este video si no recuerdas alguno. And that's all for today. I'll see you next class with a new video. Have a wonderful day. Goodbye.